friends uh, today i will show you uh, the compensation of a temperature transmitter uh, with the k type uh, thermocouple i have one k type thermocouple so i will tell you what is called junction compensation so uh, in this hot communicator you, need, you can see here uh, this is atmospheric temperature showing 26 uh, degree centigrade and uh, i given the range minus 200 to uh, plus uh, 600 degree centigrade so what i did i just used the same um, lead wire cable from and i jointed here i just uh, made one joint for this experiment so i will show you that now uh, now we are getting here 26.07 degrees okay so i'm giving some heat i'm applying some heat here so we will check any temperature variations are there or not so i just given some heat and you see some little bit 26.17 or uh, 26.06 and you can see here also i am applying heat here and there is small uh, variation but not not big so the same as uh, 26 degrees centigrade okay so what i will do i will change this uh, lead wire with the copper uh, wires and then we will find out what will happen cool so you can see uh, just a new junction formed here so uh, so what I, I will do you see the temperature uh, now it's showing uh, around 24 uh, degrees centigrade so i will apply heat here let's see what will happen so i'm giving some heat here you see uh, the temperature is decreasing it is going below minus minus 80 minus 90 uh, so you see the temperature is decreasing now just i stopped in this heating process uh, so now it's showing 26 is coming to atmospheric temperature so i'm also applying heat here the second one you see the temperature is going downwards and it's showing minus 25 now i'm giving heat again applying heat you see so there is changing the temperature so that's why uh, normally we use uh, this uh, compensate cable up to transmitter or uh, in dcs uh, where the cards will be there the thermocouple cards so inside this transmitter you will find one um, thermistor or maybe after doing i think so thermistor so the thermistor will uh, measure inside uh, temperature of this uh, uh, transmitter and it will compensate uh, the output of this uh, uh, transmitter if any temperature variations will come here in this point this junction this is cold junction here so it will sense the temperature changes and it will come automatically it will compensate now in this uh, pv is uh, 24.97 degree centigrade but you can check in this cold junction compensate sensor so it's on 41 degree centigrade yeah after uh, giving some heat so the internal body temperature is increased but the actual field uh, sensor is showing 25 degree centigrade that's why we need uh, this uh, cjc cold junction compensation